A local school proves you should never underestimate the underdog. The grade school in Anawan received more than 196,000 votes to win a local contest. That delivers some real cash for the school. Local 4 Shell Logging reports what it took to get it done. Anawan Grade School pulls off a monumentous victory as the town of about 900 gets a vote total more than 200 times its size. While rain keeps recess indoors, it's a good day to be a student in Anawan as the dream of a new playground takes shape. Our playground is outdated. We want to make it safe. We want to make it inclusive for everyone. Tuesday, they got the final tally, beating out more than 2,600 schools in five states to win the $25,000 grand prize for the Unity Point Health Imagine the Amazing Contest. It came after a fierce campaign the last two weeks of September. Voted about like 150 times a day. Teachers, everyone had made a poster and they were outside. As people, cars came up, they were like, don't forget to vote. Anawan and the two other towns in the district pulled off the upset, taking first place day one and not giving it up. I have friends that live in other bigger cities that their schools were participating and they kept calling saying, what is happening over there? We thought you lived in a tiny town. The district of 365 students brought together the community. Three year olds all the way up to great grandmas who are 95, 96. With support from far and wide. Whether schools started to vote, uh, relatives, grandparents, aunts, uncles, friends. While celebrating a win, it's also turned into a teachable moment about chasing a dream. Doesn't matter how small you are or where you come from, if you put your mind to it and you're committed, you can do anything you want. The $25,000 will really only serve as a start for the school as they look to replace the aging playground equipment. They tell me the options they're looking at range between $80,000 to more than $100,000, but say the goal is to make sure that this place is safe for kids when they play. In Anawan, Sean Logging, Local 4 News. Nice job, though.